Thank you, Carlos. Hi everyone, I'm Sabina, UX designer at the MOVIS team in the Educational Solutions Department. And yeah, I'm going to cover briefly uh, the UX status and progress of the course hierarchy project that the MOVIS will be working or mostly implementing on the 4.4 release. So if you go to the next slide, Adrian, please. Yeah, so during these last months, we've been able to continue with the design and the testing phase of this project and we've been conducting two phases of usability testing. The first phase was conducted remotely through UserZoom, and we were testing with seven model teachers and content creators, and four non-model teachers, um, and then finally with five non-model students. Based on the first research findings, we improved the prototypes and conducted the second testing phase during the global mode this year. Uh, where we talked to eight uh, model community users who were mostly content creators and educator, educator uh, support. And you can have a read on the findings report of these two phases in these slide links at the end of the slide that you see here. Uh, so you, if you go to the next slide, Adrian. Yeah, thank you. So the key findings of, of the second research phase uh, were mainly positive and we found the majority of pain points around the new functionalities that were added, specifically the option to add sections or subsections between already created content, or also the ability to open individual and isolated section and subsection pages. The most of the key uh, the, the rest of the key findings were very, very positive. Uh, and now we are in the, after analyzing the results of the second research phase, we are working on the high fidelity prototypes for the educators and the student users. Uh, if you go to the next slide, a slide I turn, please. Um, yeah, so uh, in the right side, you see um, like a screenshot of how the prototype is looking in high fidelity right now. And we are going to be uh, working on these uh, prototypes uh, for this week that will be ready for ready for the new increment planning meetings. Um, and yeah, I think in the next showcase we'll be showing a demo um, of the functionalities. But for now, this is what we have for the uh, UX uh, update. So that's that's it from me.